can get into a very very disproportionate uh, I would say uh, debate. So to size the stent more precisely, you can go with the vessel size assessment. Vessel size deducted by 0.5. If you have 3.5 vessel, so 0.5 minus karke. If you size are that should be your stent selection size in a disease artery. Clear? Yeah. So these are the four stent assessment on IVAS. Apposition, expansion, expansion and stent age related uh, dissections. Now this point we have already discussed that what is the acceptable range of stent expansion during uh, because throughout the procedure you will keep seeing the residual plug there always and you will always tend to take a bigger size balloon to over expand the stent in that region. But that is not the way. There will be a residual plug. You have to assess the, the MLD at the tighter segment. If you are achieving the 90% of your distal referral, then that is good enough to leave that residual plug. As long as your stent is well opposed, there is no other complications like tissue prolapse or age related dissections. You can leave that uh, residual plug as long as your MLD is 90% of your distal referral. Okay. This is what we have just seen. Area zero. Now quickly, uh, okay. so we will quickly go into the another side. Uh, if time permits, can I show you some uh, good images on or uh, you can. low contrast PCI? Okay. 